Hi, I'm Brian. This is my homemade tool I made for uh, getting the lids, the tops, off of the seltzer bottles. Um, a little bit about it, it's a piece of plywood, or it's an old pallet, two by four from a pallet. Put these on there so that uh, you have some room. It'll become obvious in a second. Um, I just took a drill and drilled this out and made the slots. You also, you're also going to need, what you're going to need is you're going to need your tool. You're going to need a wrench similar to this. Obviously your seltzer bottle and it's good to have a towel to catch the, uh, any moisture that's going to come out of there. So what you do is I'm going to stick the seltzer bottle in the slot. And as you can see, it sticks out and it's, that's why these are there. Okay. Now we're going to set this on the ground. We have some leverage. You slip the Stelzer bottle in. Just kind of lean on this. Now we're going to grab the, um, the shim here. And we're going to turn the shim and the bottle at the same time. and it will just unscrew. The shims are either gonna be plastic or lead. And as you can see, some of the uh, old seltzer water coming out there. just unscrews. At that point you just pull it out. Okay. Now you'll see they come apart, which is like they're supposed to. They're threaded. There's little um, indentations so that when you put it back together, they go back together correctly. It's usually going to be a glass tube. It'll come out, and there's going to be a rubber gasket, and that's about it. What makes it work is, there's a lip here in the glass. When it's together, these shims go up against the lip, and that, when it tighten it up, it pulls this down nice and tight and keeps a nice tight seal. It's pretty ingeniously made a long time ago, but works great today.